I think there are several factors that are important if you look back today. First of all, at the time, the overall sentiment of the government and the society really was so open-minded that people were ready to embrace any idea so long as it works to promote our economy and to make China a better place. Secondly, the, the political leaders in China at the time were also open enough that they, they were ready to listen to younger people, to people from the grassroots, any place. Thirdly, of course, we have all these people who are willing to help so very soon. This, with that internet as we have today, mm -hmm. very soon our idea were known everywhere. Since then, you were the founder of those of the China's capital market, but that was one role. And then later you moved to the administrator's role as the vice chairman of uh, China's Securities Regulatory Commission twice, back and forth. What has that role switching meant for you? At, at the beginning, every time when the government or someone tried to persuade me to join the government to be a seemingly higher and at the minister, you know, level or something, I always refused. Many times, when, when I say, well, would you like to join mm -hmm. the government? I would say, no. Why? I said, well, after working in the system for a few years, I realized that I'm, I'm not cut for a bureaucrat. But somehow I was persuaded because, of, you know, first of all, I, have, I had ideal and idealistic um, goals. And secondly, there are all these very good people in the government who were telling us, you know, this is important. If you don't do it, some other people would have to go to do it. And then, you know, you look at other people and say, well, you may be your, you can do it better. Mm -hmm. So by and by, I, I got persuaded into it. Out of my own, you know, desire to work purely for the system, for, for, the, uh, for the betterment of the system, and without any personal agenda, I think that's great. What do you make of what happened last year, some of the ups and downs, just as an academic? And how do you think moving forward, solving the problems as you are always eager to. Right, today as People's Delegate, I just submitted my proposal to the People's Congress. Um, what is it about? It's about the, to clarify the responsibilities and functionalities of the Securities Regulatory Agency. That's just part of my proposal, <laughs> I have two parts. The other part, uh, the proposal to, to, um, to work out a, a post-crisis uh, uh, post crisis method. I know you're trying to, to translate the Chinese into English. Right, right. Um, of the, um, you know, of what happened during that uh, crisis period. Mm -hmm.